So we go to question four. Um, it says a tortoise can run with a speed of zero point one zero meters per second, and a hare can run twenty times faster, twenty times as fast. In a race, they both start at the same time, but the hare stops to rest for twenty minutes. The tortoise wins by a shell that is twenty centimeters. How long does the race take? And B what is the length of the race so now um, this question may seem hard but it's actually easy when you lay out the details so when you're going to lay out um you're going to analyze the motion of the tortoise the motion of the tortoise um first then you go to the hair so now the tortoise were being told to say it can run with the speed so this is our data it's like it's our data our data so now um the velocity is equal to 0 0.1 meters per second and then we are being told that it wins by 20 centimeters so now its distance will be given by the distance um so this is the velocity of the tortoise this is the, velocity, this is the distance of the tortoise will be given by x plus um 20 centimeters then the time the time t that's the time of the turtle is going to be equal to well we just set it as t and then we're going to go to the here yeah so the velocity of the hair is going to be equal to 20 times the velocity is going to be 10 vt which oh 20 sorry 20 it was 20 times so 20 times the velocity of the turtle and then um this one will just be equal to when you multiply this one by 20 you are going to have two meters per second as your as your velocity for the hair and then when you get the distance the hair is just going to be equal to x since the um, distance for the tortoise is x plus 20 so this one where where this one this one ended at x this one was ahead by 20 centimeters and then 20 centimeters is can be converted into meters since we are using meters in this case so it's going to be 0 0.2 meters and then so that's x plus 0 0.2 meters so in our our of our time for the hair to finish the race um the, the hair didn't actually finish the race so now um it was behind by 20 minutes when the when the race stopped um the hair was behind by 20 minutes so we're going to set time by two minutes rather minus two minutes but then we're dealing with seconds so i'm going to convert the two minutes into seconds so that's two times 60. so the time for the hair was t minus 1 20. and then now we are going to use um the equations the kinematics equations for the hair and also for the um, for the hair and for the um, for the tortoise as well so i'm going to start um with since you're given speed time and distance i'm going to say um speed which is the velocity in this case is equal to distance over time and then since we're solving for time or you can just write it like this then are going to sort out everything at the end so now the velocity for the tortoise is 0 0.1 the distance is x plus 0 0.2 over the time is just t and then for the hair the velocity is 2 the distance is x and then the time is t minus 120 then since these are this you can these equations have got the same values we have got two equations with two unknowns here this is our equation one this is our equation two so i've got two equations with two unknowns um so now we try to make one the subject of the formula in any of these and then the easiest that you'll find is i think making x a subject of the formula here we are going to say x is equal to 2t minus 120 
So when you replace x there, you are going to cross multiply here first. You are going to cross multiply, going to have 0 0.1 t is equal to x plus 0 0.2. So where there is x, you are going to put where there is x, you are going to put um this here. So you are going to have 0 0.1 t is equal to 2 t minus 120 plus 0 0.2. So 0 0.1 t is equal to 2 t minus 2 40 plus 0 0.2. So then you're going to to make this subject to a formula, you're going to um move this one that side so that you're going to have 0 0.1 t minus 2 t is equal to negative 240 plus 0 0.2. You're going to have 238. 238 point um let's just try that on our calculator 240 minus 0 0.2 so that's 239 239 point eight and then this side you're going to have negative one point nine this one is negative as well is equal to two thirty nine point eight so then when you divide both sides by negative 1.9 over negative 1.9, you're going to have your t being equal to 239 divided by 1.9. That's 126.2 seconds. And then look at this time. That's the time t here. T is equal to the time the turtle spent in the race. So now the turtle ran the whole race. So now the time that the turtle spent is the time that the whole race um is the total time for the whole race it's like um two people are running and then one person runs for 20 minutes and wins then um the race will be for 20 minutes because the other one might run um maybe for for 10 but then this guy who ran for 20 is all the way there so i'm going to consider his time because this guy is going to stop somewhere there before this um after this guy has already won so now um we go to we go to the b part of the question it says what is the length of the rest so what is the length of the rest um the length of the rest will be given by the length of the rest will be given by when we look at this one um the length of the rest is the time that the turtle spent the the distance sorry that the turtle walked because this guy did not run up to the end just as i was giving you the example here this guy only ran up to somewhere when the turtle won the the race was won so this guy obviously stopped so now the distance that this guy um had to run the turtle in this case that's the total distance that we're looking for so now we're going to say um from here x of the turtle is equal to x plus um 0 0.2 so now um we're going to get we don't have our x so we're going to get um equation this equation there, you can label this as your equation one maybe, if you like to label equations. So x t is equal to um, two t minus one twenty plus um, zero point two. So then our x t is going to be equal to then our t again. We have to find out what t is. Well t is given by 126.2 so we're going to say 2 our t is 126.2 minus 120 plus 0 0.2 um, x t is equal to 2 here the this one when you subtract 6.2 plus 0 0.2 6.2 times 2 that's i think 12.4 is it x t is equal to 12.4 plus 0 0.2 so then when you add 12.4 plus 0 0.2 the x total is going to be equal to 12.6 um, meters so then you found your length and you found um, how long the rest took so that's all for question 4 we go to question 5